Hey everybody. Hi everybody. I'm Steve. I'm Donna. We are Happy Heart Treasures, resellers in Lincoln, Nebraska. Rehomers of stuff. Yes, we came back yesterday from the Plains to Profit reseller rally in Omaha. It was the first one of that type it we was attended. It was a blast. And we had so much fun. Thanks everybody who put it on and everybody who came. It was so much fun. Yes, you may have seen our last video was Friday's footage of when we went thrifting from that day when we first got there. Uh, that's the only footage we took Saturday. We were too busy having fun. Well, we were going to film, and then we just decided to make the decision, you know what, let's just enjoy the day yes. instead of worrying about filming at all. We have a few and clips it was of great. us, um, me, dumpster diving. Oh, that'll be, uh, I think Inked Picker is going to put out a video with uh, dumpster diving. It was Resell to Ride, Inked Picker, and Donna. Resell to Ride was the one filming, so maybe it'll be on both. Okay, well, somebody's going to put it, and when <laughs> they do, we'll... Uh, We'll, we'll, uh, somehow we'll put it out. Yeah. Somehow we'll get it we'll to you. But it. yeah, they went dumpster diving on Friday night. <laughs> so we had a great time. We're so glad we went. We are not really people person. We never had met any other YouTubers. We didn't hardly know any other resellers except for people like on the dollar auction yeah. that we know. And so we were kind of like, eh, okay, let's go. But we were nervous. Uh, with a little bit of a, oh, there goes our fencing. The wind is Sorry, blowing. the wind is blowing. Oh. Oh no! Oh. Man. Oh man! It just broke. It blew over and broke the flower pot. Well, that's a bummer. There's the remnants. The remnants of the big flower pot. Have to clean that up. Well, that is unfortunate, but that's life. <laughs> Things happen, right? Yes. So anyway, we had a great time. Uh, want to thank a few people real quick. And then we have a lot of what well, sold. Well, you're welcome. Yes, thank you, Donna. <laughs> for making you thank go. Thank you for making me go. And we just got a cha-ching. Ooh. Um, yeah, real quick. Let's. We have 28 things to sell. Sell. We have 28 things that I have to ship on me. that we sold. It was a very good weekend. <laughs> it's like the thrifting gods. The eBay gods knew that we were doing there's not reselling such a work. Thing. I know there's not. Um, so anyway, we had a lot of things. So we don't even have a topic for today. But very quickly before we get into the what solds. I uh, just wanted to thank Grams and Pops Vintage yes. and uh, Inked Picker yes. and the Happy Picker and the Grumpy Picker for putting on this event because yes. it was a lot of fun. And I can't wait to see a lot of the footage that people filmed. There were a lot of YouTubers there, so there's going to be a lot of different videos mm -hmm. for it. So And Instagram. And Instagram. We, learn, we learned a lot of things. We're actually going to put a list together and do a video of all the things that we learned and we need and to thank change. thank you to Hannah for filming it all. Yeah, Hannah, that's Grams and Pops' daughter. She did a lot of footage, a lot yeah. of filming, so a uh, lot of stuff to look forward to. Anything else before we get into this? Let's do it. said 28 things. Yes. We gotta blow through these fairly quickly. I gotta do all the shipping yet. Yes! So, all right, we have 28 things. It is 29, we just sold a video game for 11.99, so we're not gonna run and go get it, but hey, we will take that every day. Yes. All day long in my store. All day long in my store. <laughs> All right, let's start off with the one that if you watch our videos, you saw on the last video that it sold, and that is this Carhartt used. We got this on our thrift trip this weekend. Yes, Plains of Profit. Got it at the Goodwill bins. So I'm guessing it probably cost 80 cents, and it sold for $20 <laughs> plus shipping. Yay. So that's awesome. We got a lot of things. We have some low dollar things, yep. and we have a few higher dollar things. Mid-range. It's a really big variety of what we got today. So, here we go. Peanut butter. Peanut butter. <laughs> Peanut butter. Peanut butter falcon is the name of this video. Peanut butter falcon is a DVD, and it sold for $8.79 plus shipping. I know I say sh plus shipping too much, but that's a King Kong Lives. A VHS tape for $4.79, King Kong Lives. This is a puffy t a kite. That is from the 70s. I don't remember the year exactly. It's on there somewhere, but... 76, I think it said. I can't read it. It's right there. 1973. 73. It was $1.29 in 1973, and now it sold at for... Pomida. At Pomida. At Pomida, and now it sold for... $20 plus shipping. Yep. The Fat Bat. Fat Bat. This is a little sampler. It's a watermelon needlepoint sampler by Sunset. And that sold for $6.50. Okay. 
one clothing item. Well, we have shoes, but one piece of clothing. And that is this Polo Ralph Lauren Polo. Ralph Lauren Polo. From Polo Ralph Lauren. Polo by <laughs> Ralph Lauren. <laughs> uh, let's see. Okay, and that Polo by Ralph Lauren. Polo. So that it's Polo by polo Ralph brand Lauren. It's a by Polo Ralph by Polo Lauren. Ralph Lauren. And it sold right. for ten dollars. A polo polo. A polo polo. Can you reach those? Uh yeah. Last week you saw I think we had it in a video even. We yes, did. Yes, we did. We sold I almost it. dropped it. Yes. I did drop it. A set of these, they're Bradford uh little lantern Christmas ornaments. Christmas trimmeries by Bradford. Well Donna found two more boxes. The last one sold for thirteen dollars. These sold for fifteen dollars each. Same buyer. Uh, is it the same buyer? Yep, yep. Nice. Asked about combined shipping, so we bought them for $15 a piece, so $30 plus shipping on that. That's awesome. You know, we sold, we showed them some plates that we sold, so a little tea set that looks a lot like this. And they were actually uh, in the, the same, same box, so I, I'm, I bet you Chris and Amy bought them at the same place. Yes, but is it the same buyer? It is not the same buyer. Oh, this is but just this a plate platter. that would match those tea sets. Yeah. Sold for thirteen dollars and twenty four cents. Nice. Not okay, the only break, not many is. breakable things today, which I'm really happy about after last week. Whew. This is a Night of the Demons pin, a pin back from a movie, and in the nineties, uh, this was a promo pin, and I have five more of these, I think, and this sold for eleven ninety nine. Wow. It's so soft inside, you guys. I had to put it on my hand. <laughs> it is a... Um, PXG Golf Driver Head Cover. Oops. You got that at the bins last time we were there, and it sold for $7.50. Yes. Easy to ship. A lot of easy to ship things today, which is fantastic. These are yours. Yes, these were mine. I made a decision recently. I've been thinking about it for a long time. I have a PS4. I used to play video games a lot, and I haven't played any video games. Like, I've probably played games three times in the last, like, two to three years. Oh, uh, yeah. And I so uh, I decided to sell my play PS4. I got to wait until I got a Bluetooth player. Bluetooth. Blu-ray player. So I got a Blu-ray player at a state sale a couple weeks ago. So I cleaned up my PS4, and I listed it, and I have my Turtle Beach headset. Uh, there's a microphone in there and the cables and stuff, and I put it on. That sold for, I think, $36.99, I believe. Sorry, Chris. <laughs> That's all right. You used to play with Christopher, our cousin. I should be listing and not playing games anyway when my free time because That's one of it's the... a lot more fun to yeah. uh, sell things. Yes. Honestly. This is another head cover. Yep. This one's really cool. Tailor made, but you can turn this little knob and change which one you put in it I guess right yeah, it's tailor-made rocket balls fairway wood head cover for ten dollars and eleven cents that sold for nice okay the next thing was a Donna find at a garage sale this is a vintage 1950s Gillette tech fake light handle razor and that sold for do you know how much $29.99 $29 pretty darn close $29. $29. Yeah. So that's awesome. Awesome sale. Then we we'll sell we'll have, sell anything. Yeah, we have this little handle and this actually helps you It's for Pyrex Pyrex. Pyrex, yeah. Pyrex flameware, removable hold handle. Hold on to your Pyrex. Yeah. And that handle sold for 11.99. That's easy to ship too, huh? Yes. This one's not as easy. Not as easy, but not too bad because it's not that big. This is a vintage Bernard Pothast Noonday Meal 1932 framed print lithograph. Um, they probably bought it just for the frame, honestly, but but that, that sold, I think that sold Friday night, like when we, yeah, Friday sometime. Anyway, that sold for $23.99. Very good. And then we have an older... Um, Bath and Body Works? Pattern, yeah. Into the Night is the flavor, the scent, and it's lotion. And it sold for $10.39.
We have a piece of Tupperware. Tupperware. And it's... Tupperware is easy to ship too. It's not real breakable. A, I believe it's a cheese keeper. Yes. Velveeta Block Cheese Butter Keeper. Yep. Uh, sold for $10.39. Did I already say that? I don't know. It sounds like a number I just said. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna... $10.39 <laughs> if you missed it. Yeah. What else you got? Um, let's see. That is... I have this... Apartment 56. Yeah, it's, it's um, flexi... I don't know how to say that word. It's a flexible... Sissel... Sissel... Hedge. Snow-covered hedge. So basically, it is just the hedge for the town. For the city. Looks like there's snow on it. And this yeah. one has a box and this one doesn't. So, so there's sold six them together. total pieces. Yeah. Yeah, six total pieces sold for sixteen fifty. Plus yeah. shipping. I'm trying to say plus shipping less. But, but you I say think it about every, every time. other time is in my limit. <laughs> okay. Are you oh, another great you sale by Donna. That is a gunned Brennan animated singing dancing dog for St. Patrick's Day. Yes. And that sold for $29.99. We need to take the batteries out That's to a ship it. Great sale. Good find, Donna. That was not a find. That was from a clean out we did in Columbus. Well, a buyout we did in Columbus. You found it in a box. Yeah. Good find in the box. <laughs> This little guy is another one of the Home Co. Porcelain Heritage Co Ma Masterpiece Porcelain Collection that he had a buyout for. A $250 buyout we did a video for, and this one sold for $14.99. Yep, and it's signed on the back right there from 1986. You think I should sign it too? No. You get a Sharpie and no. I'll sign it too? No. 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 And here's a vintage Napco wear Siamese kitten with blue eyes. Isn't it cute? This sold for eleven dollars plus shipping. It's cute, cute. We got oh. four pair of shoes. Yep. A lot, you know. We don't sell any shoes for a long time, and then all of a sudden we have four. Here's a pair of Asics, um, and they sold for eighteen dollars plus shipping. Plus shipping. <laughs> Uh, here's a pair of DC Anvil Canvas Skate Trainers men's shoes, and those sold for $13. We'd had them a while. I got $13 offer. It was kind of low, but I was kind of in the mood just to move them on. They've been here long enough. Uh, here's a pair of Born Handcrafted. Hang on. I got to get a hold of them. They're kind of big. Oxford shoes from the brand is Born, um, and that sold for $21.15. They've been here a while. They were part of that... Uh, the buyout from our cousins a year and a half ago. Y'all, it's hot in here. We got it's 80 degrees and it it's is, February. It is 81, actually. Oh my goodness. And then, hey, it's 81 degrees. It's Monday, February 26th, I think. Mm -hmm. And Tuesday into Wednesday, we might get up to an inch of snow. Come to Nebraska, <laughs> they said. <laughs> It'll be great, they said. Here's a pair of Rockport. Uh, men's shoes, these sold for $20 plus shipping. But plus you shipping. know what? We had perfect weather for the resale rally. We did. It could have been a blizzard, and it was beautiful. All right, here's a fun one. It's a Steve Bunker. <laughs> right? Donk. Uh, this is a swing trainer, golf swing trainer. It's called an Orange Whip. That's what it's called, and it's for uh, practicing and training your golf swing. Is it adjustable? I have no video of me trying this. No, Let's it's not. Let's not make one. And that's all I can tell you about it. It's, it's, it's like a, a microphone. microphone. Um, oh that sold goodness. for $58.36. How are you going to ship that thing? In the mail. Okay. In a box. Last thing we got. We got through this pretty well. We've sold one of these before. We just sold another one. This is a DMC branded case. It says DMC on the drawers. And it's... <laughs> You all right? Yeah. And they're full of DMC floss. Um, every, all three drawers are just full of it. You're full of it. I thought that was coming. Ah. Uh, and that sold for $106. Yeah. 
plus, plus ship. shipping. <laughs> so that's our that's our 28 things. Um, Donna was gone this morning, and I made the last video that we already just put out. Oh, it's fun one. You yeah, if you haven't it. seen the video before this. We went on a party bus. <laughs> yeah, we went thrifting with the big group from the Plains of Profit. We had dancer poles in the party bus, and the driver <laughs> danced on them. Yeah, the driver showed us how it worked. He did a little slide off the, slip, the stripper pole, so that was funny. But uh, there was no stripper pole usage no. during the thrifting Just to hold rally. on to, because yeah. <laughs> I couldn't stay on this leather seat. It was kind of slippery. <laughs> yeah, but it was a lot of fun. Uh, we're going to ship this and get it going and then get to listing again because i like shipping a lot of things i like selling a lot of things so in order to do that we need to list a lot of things and, and we yet, have a lot we of learned to this weekend that we need to step up our listing game yes we now we to be fair we do dollar auction and nobody else does that was there but everybody else's ebay stores are just Way so much bigger, bigger more listings yeah. more sales than ours and so i think we've gotten kind of lax about the ebay and so we don't so want to do that. So this is why we're having the garage sale coming up on March 9th from 8 to 4. And we are getting rid of lots and lots and lots of items. We're going to try to clear, clear out, out and everything. make more space. So, so when garage sales hit, we can just, we have room yep. to get whatever we want. So come on over for some good deals. Yep. Make sure to like and subscribe. <laughs> Share with your friends if you'd like to. Yeah. Check out Inked Picker, like we said on the other video. Yeah, and Grams and Pops Vintage. Grams and Pops, happy um, They've done a lot to help us, and we really appreciate it. So, yeah. Resell to Ride, all those yeah, guys. Yeah, Resell to Ride. They're a lot of fun. A lot of fun with them. Okay. So, it was great. Great time. But now it's back to work, right? Back to work. All right. All right, well, I'm going to go start shipping, and Donna's going to clean up the massive pot mess. It's not pot. It's a po flower, flower pot, pot mess mess. All right. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Peace, Steve. And she's Donna. <laughs> Bye. Bye.